If you could offer hope to someone dying from a blood cancer, would you? Many would leap at the opportunity. We're here to let you know what's possible. Hello, we're Mission Marrow, an organization based in Heritage High School at Frisco, Texas. Mission Marrow is an organization focused on raising awareness for the currently non-diverse donor pool within the stem cell registry. We're currently working on diffusing stigmas surrounding the bone marrow donation process by offering clarification to the general public on the scientific background of donation. In addition to this, we're raising awareness and support for a fellow student of Heritage High School. His name is Daryl DeGenio, and he's a 2019 graduate in need of a stem cell donation. He's currently in a battle for his life as he suffers from a rare disease called aplastic anemia, a condition in which the blood is unable to produce new blood cells. As of now, he receives weekly blood transfusions. This is because he's been unable to find a match, partly because of the lack of diversity in the registry. Daryl and his family are Filipino-American, and because of the lack of Filipinos in the registry, he has a significantly lower chance of finding a match. My team and I were fortunate enough to get in contact with a bigger organization called Be The Match, and they've been willing to help us on this journey to bring awareness to Daryl's cause. As I mentioned before, the registry is lacking in a diverse donor pool for stem cells and bone marrow donations. Some of this is due to the myths that surround the bone marrow donation process. However, with new technology and medical innovations, donating bone marrow is a much simpler process than ever before, and it's now as easy as donating blood. Despite this, the coronavirus pandemic has vastly affected many people, just like Daryl, who are looking for a match and we've been forced to switch to a virtually oriented swabbing approach. This new approach has pushed us to further our online outreach and hold digital drives with multiple other organizations. This is where you come into the picture. Our target audience is 18 to 44 years of age. To join the registry, it only takes five minutes to fill out a survey and order a free swab kit to your home. After swabbing, all you have to do is mail the kit back free of charge. If you match a patient in need, there are two ways to donate. In 75% of cases, donors are asked to donate via a non-surgical procedure called PBSC, or Peripheral Blood Stem Cell Donation, while 25% of the time, doctors request marrow donation. PBSC donation is a non-surgical outpatient procedure called apheresis. Marrow donation is a surgical outpatient procedure that takes place in a hospital operating room. Due to new breakthroughs in marrow donation technology, the process is easier and more painless than ever, and can have donors back to the normal schedule in as little as two days. If you match a patient, it is required that Be The Match inform the patient and the patient's family that they matched a donor, regardless of if you decide to go through with the donation process. This is why it is extremely important that you stay committed to donating whilst you are on the registry, as it can be devastating if a potential donor, which can take years to find for some patients, declines to donate. As volunteers, people are never under any legal obligation to donate. About one in every 430 US Be The Match registry members go on to donate to a patient in need. Please join my team and I in our mission to help Be The Match save more lives. Signing up is simple, easy, and can be done from the comfort of your own couch. Together, it's up to us to up the odds.